Oh, shit. Michael, we got one. As I'm breaking up, Kowalski is on. Check one, two. How are they sounding? Crispy. As I'm breaking up, Kowalski is on. Yes, go! Let's go! Oh my god. Fuck, that's so cool. Ah! Oh, god, let's go, dude. That is so sick. This is Mike from Fly All Season, and this is Meat Hang 2020, baby. Rio Grande edition. Good morning from New Mexico, folks. It is a bright early morning here on the Rio Grande. And I tell you what, Kowalski, I had the strangest dream last night. Oh yeah? Dude, I, it was a kind of a nightmare actually. I had a dream that day one of me hang was a total freaking bust. <laughs> we, <laughs> yeah. Full skunk? Full skunk, like the really? whole thing. Teeth no kicked way. in and everything, just. Oh, that would suck. I would so suck. Oh, good thing that didn't happen. Yeah, good thing that didn't happen. Oh. Screw this shit. we're going to the Rio Grande. Okay, so me hang was pretty bad. <laughs> Day one was pretty rough, but we pivoted. We're here on the Rio Grande. Legend, it's it, it's it's supposed to have some of the best fishing here in New Mexico. So fingers crossed we can get into something. We got an early start, brecky down good, wasting no time. So we'll get out there and uh, yeah, try and get some get some fishes. While Kowalski does some casting, I'm rigging up my other two rods. We're gonna try for a three-point approach, one deep, medium, and then a shallow rig, and just see where it lays, because the Rio Grande has a lot of variability in its water, so we're gonna try and target that as best we can. Oh, shit. Michael! As I'm rigging up, Kowalski is on. Oh shit. We got one on accident. Oh, how I've needed you. Freaking first fish of the meat hang. Oh my God. We did it. Kowalski. We did it. Oh my God. We no, did you it. did it, dude. Jesus Christ. I caught him on accident, dude. Look at him, folks. That means the freaking world, dude. Let's go. <laughs> After Holy After a whole day of being skunked. Oh, bro, there we go, folks. Oh, Kowalski. That is so sick, man. For them way up it. and out towards me. There we go. That's the shot. Dude, that's so sick. Let's see him back. Oh, oh. and he's gone. <laughs> I'm not even rigged yet, and you're freaking in him, dude. That is the biggest fishy nuts of dude. the trip. Folks at home, you have no idea how much that little rainbow, well not so little rainbow, how much that nice rainbow means right now. Whew, man. That is so sick. Like Freaking said, first run too. Dude, like I said, I, literally, I, came up, I saw a fish jump over there, so I came over here, yeah. and then I just had, it was the fly was just in the water right there as I was um, reeling out. <laughs> And then I go to I go to cast. I was like, oh, I'm snagged. <laughs> oh no, there's a fish. <laughs> oh. Then I I hear Mike, Mike. That was awesome. It's been so long since we caught a fish. 
Holy cow. All right, I need to get rigged up and in the game. I don't think you folks at home have any freaking clue how much this little fish means to me. It's having some serious net problems, but that right there, folks, is our first New Mexico trout. A beautiful, wild Rio Grande brown trout. <laughs> Holy actual cow. He came up, I was skating my big stonefly across, and he came out and just swiped it in front of a boulder. Just an absolute gorgeous little fish. Oh, that's so cool, look at that. <laughs> Let's go, baby. All right, I'm gonna get him back. Hope that's in range for you, Mike. Good little, little speckled boy. I can't believe I've let it go on for this long without realizing it. We just got too caught up in the day. But Kowalski caught his first fish on his new rod. And as tradition, the plastic must come off. Oh baby, that is that is just something else. Fresh cork for the viewers. Wow. <laughs> Freshly unraveled. Wow. That is so sick. Yeah, we totally totally. <laughs> totally forgot it. Totally forgot to do that. Well, now now it's good. Now he's got the fresh cork and he's been christened. The, the, the new rod is ready to go now. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks for reminding me, but <laughs> yeah, I totally forgot. <laughs> there we go. Oh, whoa. Yo, there's a cup rope. Holy and it popped out right at the freaking net, baby. Hell yeah. Whoa, dude. Well, folks, I don't know if this is a pure Rio Grande cutthroat, but that is a cutthroat nonetheless. That is fantastic. That is our first native of the freaking trip. Let's go. Yeah, man, that is fantastic. He's a good one, too. He's got some chompers on him. <laughs> this is seriously night and day different than yesterday. I can't tell you. This is sick, I'm gonna let him back. All right, so far both of mine have come off this golden stone. I've gotten a few follows on this mini meat whistle, but nothing too, nothing too interested to bite. So I might, I might change up and put another semi golden stone on the bottom. Let's see if we can get some more, man, that's so cool. We have found ourselves a lovely little beach to take a mid sesh snack break. So far, I would say so good. I've gotten two, you've gotten two. Too, and I lost, I lost my big one. There's a big one. But what we've been noticing is that they've been sitting in front of the rocks. I've had a couple follows. He's had a couple chases in front of the rocks. So after we snack down, we might switch a roo, maybe to a streamer rig to really target the front of the rocks and those more aggressive takes. So get fueled up and let's get after it, man. Better than yesterday. Better than yesterday. <laughs> oh. Bingo! Just trying to give you a quick look at him there. See that eye? Man, is he. He's an interesting little stalker boy. Yikes almighty. <laughs> Other side's not too bad. A little clean guy, but we'll get him back here. Ooh, hey, look. There you go. Cool. All right. I don't even know if y'all saw that. <laughs> Got that guy on the Copper John. Pretty standard rig. A little blue in there, making it nice and fiery, but yeah. That's pretty sweet. Hopefully we can get on a couple more. I'll move you up so maybe you can see me actually get on a fish this time. Mr. Larry Lobster here won't let my fly go. Maybe we'll just use him as bait instead. What do you got for us? Well, my fly broke off on a rock. No <laughs> way, are you kidding? So, had to go fight Larry the Lobster here for my fly. <laughs> oh, there it goes. Yeet, see ya bud. That's hilarious. Freaking big old crawdaddies in the Rio Grande. Who would've thought? Eek. See ya. Oh, 
Holy late freaking in the fourth quarter, Kowalski. What? We're like packing up, ready to get out of here, and he just freaking gets into a brown trout. Are you kidding me? Just dropped it in as a last say goodbye. Oh my gosh. Are you that kidding me? That is freaking unreal. As the sun's coming out, it's time to go. It's mid afternoon. The bites slowed down, and Kowalski says, No, it hasn't. That's a beautiful fish. That is so sick, man. Way to go. Way to end the day. Wow, my gosh. No kidding. Beauty Judy. See you, friend. Thank you. You! Yeet! <laughs> Meat Hang 2020, day two. <laughs> that is what you like to see as we're packing up, getting ready to go. Is that an omen? Do we need to stay? I don't know, man. <laughs> or we should we just go? <laughs> we think we should cut, we should cut our losses. Cut our losses. Yeah. End on a good note. Consider what we got lucky. Yeah, we're about to pack up and uh, yeah, head out of here. I was going to do an outro, but guess the fish was happening. <laughs> good job, man. You gotta climb that shit. <laughs> All the way up, baby. <sighs> All right, we are back at the freaking truck. Tell you what, Rio Grande has fish, that's good, but not exactly, not exactly what we're looking for just yet. We need more fish. We need more, maybe bigger, but we got some info, we gotta do some research, and uh, yeah, prep for day three because Day one, big bust. Day two, salvaged. You know, it was pretty cool getting to see that cutthroat. Couple browns, couple rainbows, and yeah, I love the river. I mean, the Rio Grande itself. Beautiful. Just absolutely gorgeous. I mean, the vistas and this, I mean, the, the canyon that we're in is just insane. The Rift Valley, I think it's called. It's a Rift Valley, right? It's a Rift Valley. Yeah, I mean, just uh, nothing I've ever seen. So that was pretty cool, but we got some work to do. First, we got to take some spigot showers and go into town. Get some grub, get some gas, and yeah, get prepped for day three. So, as always, folks, thank you so much for sticking around, watching this Helter Skelter. It's been, it's been one of those trips. So, whenever you're coming to the Rio Grande, make sure to keep your freaking feet in the water. And until next time, tight lines. Yeah. Things are looking up, I'd say. Ish. For sure. <laughs> Kowalski, do not lose this fish. That's a good fish. <laughs>